Experts predict that someone already born will live to 1,000. But what are the implications? Three, two, oh no. Hey everyone, welcome to the Optimism series, where we explore the possibility of futuristic concepts and discuss what these mean. Today's topic, biological immortality. Yep, you heard me right. Biological immortality refers to a phenomenon in which the process of deterioration due to age is halted. Just to be clear, this does not prevent us from dying by other means, but rather prevents our body from failing at older ages. <coughs> Basically, if humans were to achieve this, our bodies could potentially live indefinitely. We already see this in some species of jellyfish and lobster. So what does this mean? Well, my friends, you're in luck, because this could allow you to become a literal god. Let me explain through a completely possible timeline. This is Timmy. Timmy is 14 years old and a hard-working boy. Timmy's hard work makes him rich, and by his 40s, he's a billionaire. Good job, Timmy. It's around this time biological immortality is finally developed but is exclusive to only around 100 of the most wealthy people on Earth. Lucky for Timmy, he's among them. With this technology, Timmy continues his life for a few more years. As time moves on, say, the next 100 years, advances in technology such as nanorobotics has dramatically reduced chances of death through disease or cancer, allowing Timmy to continue his life much longer. Eventually, technology such as artificial intelligence allows Timmy to experience ultra-realistic simulations and interact with them himself. He could live any life he wants within the simulation, including his My Little Pony Friendship is Magic crossed with Walking Dead Dream. Oh dear, Timmy. But it doesn't stop there. We eventually develop true immortality, create real planets of our own design, and maybe even allow people to come back from the dead. This is where our imagination meets its limits, with near infinite possibilities through technology that we don't even know exist yet. And the best part? It can all happen in our lifetime. So slip on those old bread shoes and start working hard towards a long and bright future. Thanks for watching. Now of course there are quite a few issues regarding the technology that I didn't mention in this video which is why I'll be covering what these problems are and how they can be avoided in another one. I'll see you around.